Hey there everyone, welcome to Technisha. In this video, I will quickly show you how to find the running total of sales for a particular year and compare it to other years. How can you do it? Let's get to it. Here is the sales data for a company from year 2016 to 2018 for various months. To find the running total, the easiest method is to use a pivot table. So let's first create a pivot table. Click somewhere within the chart. Go to insert pivot table and click a new worksheet. Say OK. Now here you want to see the monthly performance of the sales amount for various years. So you can put the years in the column section. In the rows you put the month which will show from January to December and the sales amount is then grouped for each year. Now this will give the sales amount per month per year in the pivot table. To find the running total you need to add cumulatively each sales to the previous month. We can find this easily in pivot tables. Let's click somewhere within the column labels and say right click and here you can say summarize value by, go to more options and then you can say show data as running total and the base field we want it as month. So just click that, say OK and now the data will show the running total for each year. We can easily visualize it by creating a chart. So let's just go to the insert tab, say we want to create a chart, a line chart and I'm going to take this. Let's just insert a slicer now for the year. Say OK. There you go. Now you have the running total and the slicer here. So if I wanted to see the performance just for the year 2018, this will give me the performance of the year 2018. And if I select 2017 or 2016, I will get that performance. And let's say I wanted to compare this year's performance to the last year. Let me hit Control and select 2017. And now you can compare two years performance. I hope that this tutorial was of use to you. If you liked it, please subscribe to my channel. Till next time, ciao.